<laughs> Praise the Lord. Let's knock our head here. A.J.A. A. Brother W. Jr. Brother says, we turn our Bibles to Leviticus chapter 14. We'll be looking at verse 14 to 17. And it reads, And the priest shall take some of the blood of the trespass offering, and the priest shall put it upon the tip of the right ear of him that is to be cleansed, and upon the right thumb of his right hand, and upon the great toe of his right foot. And the priest shall take some of the log of oil and pour it into the palm of his own left hand. And the priest shall dip his right finger in the oil that is in his left hand and shall sprinkle of the oil with his finger seven times before the Lord. And of the rest of the oil that is in his hand shall the priest put upon the tip of the right ear of him that is to be cleansed and upon the thumb of his right hand and upon the great toe of his right foot upon the blood of the trespass offering. May the Lord add a blessing to the reading, to the hearing, to the admission, to the application, to the distribution of this great word, taken from the greatest book that man could ever possess. I'm a to this God's word. We give God all the honor, all the glory, all the praise in the precious name of his son, our Lord and Savior Jesus. Praise the Lord. Amen. <laughs> praise the Lord. Brothers and sisters, we see in Leviticus chapter 14, uh, Moses is given instructions by Jehovah God of how the high priest is to cleanse the leper, the, the procedure, the protocol to follow when cleansing a, a, a leper. And the, the high priest is to um, conduct this ceremony. And the high priest in, in this ceremony that's to be conducted where he's cleansing the, the leper, the high priest represents our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. And the leper represents sinful man. And so we see in verse 14 where it says, And the priest shall take some of the blood of the trespass offering. And so the priest, representing our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ, taking the, the, the blood, which represents our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ, what he did on the cross, shedding his blood, on the cross, the trespass offering. The trespass offering uh, signifies the the, 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 the the trespass that was against God, that the person did against man, and also the trespass that was against man. And so it says in verse 14, and the blood of the trespass offering, and the priest shall put it upon the tip of the right ear of him to be cleansed. Of him to be cleansed would be the leper. Of him to be forgiven of sins would be the sinner. So the, the high priest who represents our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ. He, he, he would he put the, 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 the blood of the trespass offering. Again, that trespass offering, the sin that was against God, the sin that was done by man against man. And the sin that man was, was against man. And so put the trespass offering, uh, the blood, on the right ear. And, 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 and then we see here, to be cleansed, to be forgiven. And upon the thumb of his right hand, the, the priest will take that trespass offering blood and put it on the, the, the thumb. The right thumb. And, up, and upon the great toe of the right foot. And then the high priest representing our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ. And the trespass offering blood which represents the shed blood of our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ. Will then put that blood on the great toe of the right foot. And so the, 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 the hearing is, is, is cleansed. What what they the the works that they're gonna do is cleansed by the blood, and their walk by the great toe with the blood is going to be cleansed. Then we see in verse fifteen, and the priest now the priest does this, and the priest shall take some of the log of oil. So he takes this big log of oil, and and he pours it. On his left hand, the priest, the priest representing our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ, pouring the oil, the oil representing the Holy Spirit, 
in his left hand. And then, and in verse 16 it says, And the priest shall dip his right finger in the oil that is in his left hand. All that oil, the Holy Spirit, he'll dip it. He'll dip the right finger into his left hand. And shall sprinkle of the oil with his finger seven times before the Lord. So he sprinkled, the high priest then sprinkles the oil on himself seven times. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And seven is God's divine perfect number. And so now the high priest who represents our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ, is now anointed. Jesus Christ, the anointed, Christ Jesus, anointed Christ, anointed Christ, anointed Jesus, the resurrected our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ. And then watch this. And the rest of the oil that is in his hand, the priest shall put it upon the tip of the right ear. So now the 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 the, the leper who's been cleansed as uh, and his blood on his, the tip of his right ear. The, the, on, on his right thumb and on the great toe of his right foot. Now the high priest now puts the oil on 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 the on the, on the tip of the right ear. The the it puts the oil on the tip of, of of the right thumb and he puts the oil on the the great right toe. What does that speak of? The blood cleanses and that the Holy Spirit responds to the blood. And so when you've been cleansed by our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ, by the tip of your right ear, the hearing is cleansed. And now you're, 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 you've, you've got discernment because now the, uh, of the spirit, with yeah, uh, discernment to, 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 to discern the things of God. And now your right thumb, which speaks about what you do, that's been cleansed by the blood, and now it's been, and now 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 you're doing good works unto the Lord, because now it's been anointed, and then your walk, which is cleansed by the blood, is now anointed. Your walk as a as a believer of the Lord and Savior Jesus Christ has been anointed. So. You've been cleansed by the blood and you've been anointed by the Holy Spirit. You've been cleansed by what our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ did on the cross. And then you've been anointed by Christ Jesus when, 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 he, when, when our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ said in Acts chapter 1, where he says, truly John baptized you with water, but I baptize you with the Holy Spirit. And again, cleansed by the blood, what you hear, what you do, and how you walk. And then anointed by the Holy Spirit, what you hear, what you do, and how you walk. And, 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 and so this is the, 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 the cleansing of, 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 the sin, of the leper, cleansing of those who to be cleansed. And the anointing of those who are cleansed unto our Lord and Savior and soon the coming King Jesus Christ. Praise the Lord! May the Lord bless you. May the Lord keep you. May the Lord face shine upon you. May the Lord lift up his constant. May the Lord give you his peace. And I commend you all to God and to the word of his grace, which is able to be, that was able to be, which is able to. <laughs> May the Lord bless you. May the Lord keep you. May the Lord's face shine upon you. May the Lord lift up his constant. May the Lord give you speech. And I commend you all to God and to the word of his grace, which is able to build you up in inheritance to those who sanctify in the precious name of his son, our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. Amen. And now to him that is able to keep you from fall and present you forth as in the presence of his glory, both glory, majesty, dominion, power, both now forevermore. Praise the Lord. Amen. Cleanse by the blood what you hear, what you do, and how you walk. And then also anointed by the Holy Spirit. What you hear, what you do, and how you walk. Praise the Lord. God bless. God bless.